name is Bribelid. I'm from Greenland. Like I walk here. I walk here from Newfoundland. It took me two years and five months. I walk half across Canada, walk across the United States. I was a fisherman. I worked on a fishing trawlers. I worked on fishing trawlers since I was eight years old until I was 19. My name is Babylid. I'm from Greenland. I was born in uh, 1948. Uh, I, I walk here. I walk here from Newfoundland. It took me two years and five months. came here with nothing at all. All I had was $5 in my pocket when I first came here. That was about uh, nine years ago when I first came here. Then these clothes I got, I got from the second hand store. All these clothes I'm wearing, I got them from some second hand store, only a couple of dollars to know. And I always put money aside for food. I worked on uh, tourist boats uh, a few times since I started living here. Just teaching uh, the captains about about the sea, how to understand it. You know, one of uh, the tourists who get separated, what they need is like a beeper. You know, it's uh, all the fishermen or wilderness travelers, word of mouth time. What uh, the government is trying to do now is try to help people, you know, instead of uh, taking the money for themselves, you now they're trying to help uh, young people and street people or people like me, you know. And I've been getting get a little bit of money now. It's, it's, it's not for me because I'm, I'm living alone now, you know. If I had someone else to uh, live with me, I, would, I, wouldn't, I wouldn't keep the money for myself, I would put the money aside for that person. What I do now here, living in the city, I, what I do is I can't handle once a day. Well, I do it uh, once a day for about uh, two and a half hours. On nice days I do it for about three hours on a, on a collect enough to uh, live on. I don't ask people at all, I use a sign. This is what I use. I walk half across Canada, walk across the United States to uh, Kubrisi. I did it for cancer after my wife died. I married my wife when I was 17. My wife's name was Ocean, Ocean Angel. That was her two names, she only had two names, Ocean Angel. She died from cancer. She was my childhood girlfriend. I started going out with her when I was about uh, 10 or 11. And when I got pregnant at 17, that's when we got married. And I had three triplets, of three girls. Oh, me and my wife, actually, me and my wife, uh, before we got married, we bumped into each other again. And uh, we recognized each other. And uh, she told me that she's pregnant now. And I told her, when I get married, then. 
people can see it at the age that I've uh, been pregnant that even a uh, teenage girl, so we decided to get married. We were both the same age, you know. And I wake up three thirty every morning and I put my cap on a wordish and I just rub it through. See the way the better is now. My wife's spirit is close to me again. She says, I always been that uh, I always been close to me. She told me she will never leave me. She will always be with me. I made one promise to her before I married her, I would never cheat on her. And that, that's been over 30, 31, 32 years ago. And I never did cheat on her once. Come a nice day. You know, I got good coffee. Thinking about my wife all day. Because I don't need anyone else. Just as long as I think about her. And besides, I've met quite a few friends since I started living here. 